Hey guys, welcome back to Tutorials and uh, it's time for another guide for you and this time I want to teach you how to create this kind of viewing platforms a very nice one with the round shapes and uh, even the bigger one almost like a building and uh, yeah that's uh, the task for today let's start off with the paths I covered this in path tutorial already but uh, it doesn't hurt to get some repetition uh, we will go with the railing on the elevated okay hold control hold shift and uh, raised with your mouth a little bit and do full circle it's pretty easy then connect to the path and you have raised viewing platform round like this uh, pretty simple pretty easy and looks good um, I suggest you use 4 meter or 8 meter wide path because uh, every building block in this game and especially the grid ones are 4 meter aligned so it will help you when you'll be uh, working on some kind of a shelter over it okay also you might ask why I didn't use just uh, one 8 meter wide path element right so let me show you if we do this with the 8 meter one um, it can connect to the path pretty ugly okay this one is too close to the path so let me let me do it again uh, like what is happening see it's even problem to connect it and when we change it to the four meter ones it will automatically change the width of that one path piece to the four meter one so that's pretty uh, bad and ugly I don't want that so I will change to, what's what's this okay I will change to four meter one again now we're gonna do one more raised path here and this time we're gonna go with uh, maybe a different path because the railing is different for every path texture we go eight meters we will create one here uh, you need at least two pieces because then you can align to grid and then you can have your shape we, we go with the square edges why not then you can have it pretty straight and uh, deselect grid and connect to the path um, you can see that it snaps perfectly in the middle that's what we want and let's finish off with the stairs now we have two viewing platforms this one is 8 meter wide and 3 blocks length this one is pretty nice round shapes with uh, 4 meter for pieces now we can create some shelters we start with the small one and we can use what we know about the pad width right we use the 4 meter one so um, we are good if we use just uh, 4 meter gridded item for the roof and follow it up maybe with some support so uh, let's go Africa maybe here because I think that Africa have uh, some very nice rounded sh uh, shapes of the roof so let's go with the touch roof this one is corner so let's go with the round one okay this one and we know that we need four of these four meter wide pieces to have perfectly aligned roof of our little viewing platform we can add some uh, column like this to the corner of it and then it just rinse and repeat select both those pieces hit ctrl D and rotate with Z do it again ctrl D Z and lower it down holding the shift and now you have perfectly perfectly done little shelter um, we can go off the group press M to move it once again you can adjust the height but now I know that it perfectly aligns to my little viewing platform because I use the correct width you can play with it a little bit but 
it should match perfectly uh, the shape of our little platform. Now I can even add some supports. If I copy this one and drag it down, it should be able, oh, it doesn't touch the ground, but you get the idea. You can do this, uh, the same stuff with those two to get the supports. Uh, this is important because when you're doing the support for your raised platform, it certainly couldn't just hang out in there by own its weight. So uh, you could do the support with basically any beams you get or uh, you can certainly use the in-game one, but let me show you that it's far from perfect. Um, here in the options you have path support for your path. So let's select that and let's use it for our little raised platform. All right, so what did we get? We did get this little, oh, let me, let me maybe <laughs> get their water out. We get just this little one awful, awful path support. It's wooden and it's not even all around. So that's uh, pretty bad. So that's why I don't usually use it. Um, certainly you could use some rocks for that. That's um, another option. If we go to the maybe nature and uh, we select tempered biome and rocks, you could use some rocks. Uh, we want position snap rotation off. And you can add some rocks to it if you want some uh, nature look of your support. Just uh, spam some rocks around and it will be working and it will look like your viewing platform resides on the rocks. Um, I suggest you rotate the rocks around a little bit or just uh, use various kind of rocks to get some uh, good look onto your support. But this is pretty good and we can even do it like this so that the actual beams are on the rocks okay this is pretty good i think we have uh, our first viewing platform done all right let's move on to the bigger platform here and we will go a little bit different direction i think let's start with some custom floor i think we can give this more more of a north american vibe i'm thinking so uh let's go to this uh wooden plank floor and we will put one down and we will try to align it perfectly to the corner of the existing path like this and put it even more down by holding your shift just so it's just tiny very very tiny bit above the floor this way the guests that will walk on it will not have their feet sunken down um, and we can copy and uh, even more you could do this on uh, the whole uh, whole platform i will show you just this little corner and it's then easy to copy it now we will give it some I, i'm thinking stone S yeah I'm, I'm thinking like a little bit of a stone bottom yes um that looks good are we nope we are not in the bottom yet so we need some more here and here and we will do the same from this side up okay it's perfect and you can even align this little bit in here i think oh not this one uh, we will need yeah, this this uh, little slope okay and then on the top i'm thinking the wood and let's let's go with just the arches uh, we need wood all right let's go with the arches like this and uh, we can even keep the railing which we might uh, change later to a different one but let me just finish this first we can have some windows from this side and uh, we will have education boards on uh, this wall so we will make it full and then put on some uh, roof um which one vertical plank roof okay plank roof seems seems nice so 
Do we have some corners? Yeah, that's... Oh, that's not actually mm, very pretty. So, uh, whatever you like. I mean, metal clad is uh, okay, I guess. Oh, that's ugly. <laughs> um, I like the clay. Let's go with the clay here. Oof, the red one is a little bit over the top. But uh, whatever, doesn't matter. You can uh, do it however you like it. Uh, we will go with some uh, trims to make it... Uh, okay, that's not the correct trim. I need this one, I think. Nope. This one. Okay. Yeah. Um, I'm just showing you one third of the overall design. You can obviously make it over your whole... Uh, over your whole, uh, you know, the platform and uh, use some doors in here or or I think these uh, arches would work even better. Yeah, even better if you do it like this way. But anyway, you get the idea and uh, yeah, let's uh, let me do it and uh, we will observe the result. Okay, there we go. It's finished. Um, all I really did is to copy the design and I changed the path texture a little bit to get different railing. It's uh, which one it is? I think I used yes. I used the parquet path because I like this railing. The parquet path is uh, hidden anyway under our uh, wooden floor, and um, I think this looks very nice, doesn't it? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Here should be another window. My bed, like this. You could. Uh, Put some glass on it. Um, basically, I mean, you could do the uh, walls any way you like. You could do even uh, this uh, little stuff any way you like. And um, but this is this is the very basic stuff, and uh, it's to show you that the viewing platforms can look pretty well, even though they are very basic. So yeah, that's it. Uh, that's the tutorial. Mm, there are many designs you could do. But uh, I think I show you the basics and uh, if you like it, hit that uh, like button and uh, let me know if uh, you were successful. Goodbye guys!